William Edmondson was an African-American folk art sculptor. He went from cutting tombstones to becoming the first African-American artist to be given a one-person show at the Museum of Modern Art. Today we feature his work in this Music City milestone in black history. Here's Tori Yates Orr. Who hasn't tried their hand at fine art? Personally, I think I nailed it. But someone who was actually a million times better than me was Mr. William Edmondson. Born in Nashville around 1874 to formerly enslaved parents, Edmondson didn't grow up with a formal education. He spent decades of his life working odd jobs and living in Edge Hill. But in 1929, Edmondson had a religious experience. He said that God told him to take up tools on his behalf. Edmondson listened and started his art career as a tombstone cutter. He then moved on to more traditional sculpture and carving. Edmondson's art started to gain in popularity due to his skill and the fact that his front yard was his workshop. His art became so well known that in 1937, Edmondson became the first African American to have a solo exhibition at the Museum of Modern Art. Edmondson passed away in 1951, but his legacy lives on. From right here at Edmondson Art Park to the auction house at Christie's, where in 2016, his piece Boxer sold for $785,000. The art of William Edmondson is a Music City milestone in black history. <laughs>